fucking two. What's going on guys? It's your boy Champagne Junior back again with another video and I know it's been a couple months but guys oh my god we finally got some cars in stock. How long has it been? I don't know. It's been a while but guys I've been waiting for this moment. I am so excited. I am currently at Elder Hyundai on Hall Road and they're letting me drive the fabulous Hyundai uh, Genesis G70. Oh my God, the G70 is fully loaded. I got the 3.5 liter uh, V6 turbocharged engine. Ah, it's gonna compare to my Kia Stinger GT2 so well. Cause you guys know currently I drive the Kia Stinger GT2 and it's just, it feels so great. It's currently August 30th and it feels so great to be able to just drive cars again. I'm so glad that inventory finally came for a car that I wanted. Cause you know, you guys know how it is trying to get cars, trying to be a YouTuber, get the car video. You're not super popular. So I'm counting on you guys to help me get up there. Help me be able to get that popular so that way it won't be that hard to get a car to film. But anyways guys, I don't want to delay. Let's go ahead, let's go that B-roll. Let's hit up the test drive. I won't waste any more of your time. Hope you're having a great freaking Monday and I'll talk to you guys in a minute. guys and we are in the g70 ah man uh, it ah uh, it, it feels like honestly they told me it was gonna be very comparable to my stinger gt2 but like i didn't believe and i'm a believer now shout outs to samantha at genesis hyundai genesis on hall road in michigan I really appreciate you for giving me the opportunity to drive this because I am interested in getting this car. And I was thinking about actually getting rid of my GT2 to go to this car. So it feels so great that I had the opportunity to drive this. So shout outs to her. Uh, her contact information will definitely be in the description. So make sure you guys check that out if you're interested in a G70 after this video. And guys, wow, like the features. I mean, when we look at the screen, I'm not gonna lie because I only have about 15 minutes in the car. The features are actually identical to the Stinger. So guys, would I buy that? I mean, you could do voice memos, you could do Apple and Android CarPlay. You have its own car navigation, phone, radio with Sirius Satellite XM, HD radio. Uh, and then you have the Genesis Connected Services, which is also like their thing, like how Kia has Uvo. So, you know, only that I just figured out today, guys don't call me a noob, but I just figured out that Hyundai actually owns Kia. And yeah, I'm such a noob. I, I, <laughs> I didn't know that. Uh, when you look at the interior, as you guys saw in the B-roll, ignore my camera stuff here. The interior is like super nice. The chairs are electronic for the passenger as well. The seats are the Napa leather because this is the fully loaded uh, G70 with the Sports Prestige package. The turbo engine, oh my God, like, ah, oh, baby. The different drive modes and everything are here of course with your cup holder and then your classic space with usb just like my stinger uh literally everything is comparable with the sink uh for the air control and everything like that so that is always like a good thing and uh, same thing you can control siri or google assistant with your voice thing you can hang up answer calls control volume and stuff for music 
uh, the semi-autonomous driving where you can keep the steering wheel automatic straight uh, and it'll keep your car on the road all that the automatic distance for cruise control to set the distance this is just great uh, fuel button and everything is over here fuel button trunk and then of course your front or not front because it's not a front but your uh, engine hood whatever call it from so you still a Tesla sorry I don't have a Tesla but you know what I mean the emergency brake is on so guys let's turn that off by switching it to drive oh my god we're gonna drive it they have eco comfort sport sport plus and custom sport plus turns traction control off we'll test that out we have regular sport mode and then we have comfort so we're gonna drive it in sport mode and I'll see you guys on the road Guys, first things first that I noticed is the whole fact that just like the Kia, because again, like I said, I'm a noob. I didn't know Hyundai owned Kia. When you turn, just like in my Stinger, you can see the blinker, so it's a camera. So it's full 360 camera view for your uh, reverse front and when you're turning. So that way you can see like your view while you're turning. This is like so, this is awesome. I, I, I like this so much. I just want to point out that little feature while I'm currently, as you guys can see, waiting in traffic. <laughs> traffic, it is, like I said, I'm recording this on August the 30th. Uh, it is currently two o'clock Eastern time. And this is what traffic in Michigan is like at two o'clock. Uh, to me, this is traffic. I know somebody are gonna, is gonna grill me in the comments like California and all that is much worse, but this is like bad to me already. So <laughs> I'll get out. Once I get out this traffic, guys, we'll reconnect and I'll talk to you. <laughs> Ah, that was just off of a turn and ah, I, I rise with my stinger so much. Oh, it feels so comparable. It's just I'm in a different cockpit. Oh my god, how can I be such a noob and not know about these? I appreciate to people in the car community at different car meets. If you know me, you know what I'm talking about. Uh that you guys mentioned this car to me. I'm so glad about getting this car to test drive, and I'm so glad that they let me get it. Let's go again at the light. I love this guys oh my god this just in regular sport mode it's not even in sport plus guys the drive uh how do I feel how do I feel what's going through my mind right now comfortable to take off because this is the all-wheel drive version keep in mind the g70 does come in rear wheel or all-wheel drive package it has the 2.0 T and the 3.5 uh, six liter oh my god do you hear that oh my god do you, do you guys hear that like do you hear that oh that's the sound of beauty that is the beauty of this car you can just like effortlessly pass people of course watching for traffic and everything you know we're good drivers guys you guys see my other videos i'm not a reckless driver we're good we're good <laughs> what am i feeling i'm feeling comfortability the napa leather seats in the g70 are amazing they feel great i have no issues it's not bucket seats like how my kia is my kia has like the bucket leather seats which are pretty cool but the napa leather is not bad uh, the feeling in this car is pretty good. Yeah, as you guys can see, I don't know if I, the camera is catching it well because the GoPro is on my head right now, but I have the heads up display. Literally all the features that my Stinger has, like even like the moonroof, sunroof thing and all of that, it's all in this car. The only difference that I spotted that Samantha told me about, shout outs to Samantha again, by the way, thank you. She's so, such an awesome person for letting me be able to drive this, is that the back of my seats in the Stinger GT2, they can be heated. So in the winter time, whenever I have people riding in the back seat, they can warm their butts up. Uh, this car does not have that feature. You can't get that as a feature. So that's the only like downside. And other than that, everything's the same. Power is very comparable. I feel like the engine sounds are different. Um, I don't know if it's an activated engine sound or if that's the sound of the car because I know like how Kia they have the activated engine sound and then if you turn it off you can hear the difference. There's nothing wrong with that if it is because it does sound great to me like why not have that sound. I noticed that the steering wheel and everything it's just a different brand like the Stinger steering wheel looks exactly the same. Uh, with the leather and everything made the same but like i said i'm a noob i didn't know hyundai owned kia so technically hyundai did it first not kia <laughs> all right 
right guys we are out of traffic as you heard with the engine sound <laughs> oh i am having too much fun guys but that is all the joy of doing what i do i love being able to do this on youtube because you guys continuously support me you guys give me the opportunity to continue to do this you guys are helping my channel grow and with that growth like it's helping me be able to drive different cars so like the more you guys support me and the more that other dealerships see this like other than the fact that i am actually genuinely interested in this car it's like you guys will help me grow my notoriety which can turn this into bigger and better things so i really do appreciate you guys and just thank you for the support now that we're at this light we're going to turn the traction control off and we're going to switch it to sport plus we're going to see as long as there's not going to be a car in front of me we're going to see how the car launches off all wheel drive from a start and sport plus let's see you guys ready Woo! i'm not going to use the paddle sifters i'm going to leave it in automatic i'm not a paddle sifter expert don't grill me in the comments but let's see let's see you guys are watching Let's listen and find out as soon as it turns green. Here we go. Oh, wow. 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 Man, I know you guys are like, what do you mean? You have the GT2 same power comparables. What do you mean, guys? Ah, uh, I just I just like new cars. I, I like driving new stuff. You know how like you have something and a novelty like wears off. Like, I love my car. Don't get me wrong, but it's like every time I'm able to drive something new, it's so awesome to like be able to do that. You know that launch felt great. It was good launch, even an automatic. I can only imagine if I was a paddle shifter expert how that would have went. But I'm just like I'm like really excited. I like that. I like that a lot. I am currently on my way back to the dealership. There wasn't really much I had to cover because, again, very similar to my GT2. So make sure you watch my taking delivery of my dream car video, or not my taking delivery, but actually the driving the Kia Stinger GT2 2022 video because that's me driving my car and I go over all the features and everything like that. So make sure you watch that if you want to know what's in this. Like I said, the only difference is about the back seats are not heated like how my car is. Yeah, I don't feel like I should repeat myself for videos because I feel like that can get a little repetitive and I don't want my videos to be repetitive. But guys, like I said, I am on my way back to the dealership and I it was a great ride. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys when I get back to the dealership. Guys, I am back at the dealership. Oh, what's that? Anyway, look at this guy. Look at the beauty. Look at the beauty that I just got to drive. If anybody is interested in the sticker price, here is that information for you now. I'll leave it here for a second. Feel free to pause the video. You was trying to find us a comfort. And I got holes in the bus. Fucking your bitches up at heavy. Well, yeah, guys. It's a drive, but it's great. Has the Brimble brakes and everything, just like my stinger. Oh, my God. Like, guys, you don't even know. <laughs> It was great. I had so much fun and I enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments another car that you want to see. Help me get my notoriety up, guys. I can't do it without you. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new to the channel, turn those post notifications on if you don't have them on already. Side note, actually, side note, you guys want to know something? I just wanted to mention that more content is coming. Uh, I've been like really busy with life and everything because I'm also a real estate agent. So remember, you can reach out to me for your real estate needs if you live in Michigan but I promise you that I'm working on getting cars uh, upcoming videos that I have in stock for you guys are uh, driving my friends uh, 2022 Dodge Charger scat pack uh, I'm gonna have like a scaring my girlfriend in my stinger video I'm gonna have so much more content coming guys because new things are happening I my creative juices are kicking in and you know, I believe in quality over quantity, guys. So that's why I'm like, I'm not uploading like a billion videos back to back every week. Like, it's like quality, guys. Like, all my videos are quality. I take care of what I do. I have a lot of passion in what I'm doing. That way, it's not like a bunch of bull crap, you know? So I appreciate the support. Please keep supporting me. Like, really, keep doing that. And guys, I will see you in the next one. Take care and enjoy the rest of your night. Bye.